And now to find out how the markets reacted to the G20 summit, we're joined from Shanghai by our reporter Timothy Pope. So Tim, what did we see happening on China's indexes Monday? Well, there were no big swings on the major indices on Monday, but we did uh, see some positive movements at least. Uh, the Shanghai Composite was in the green all day, as was the Shenzhen Component Index. Uh, the announcements made at the G20, though, are likely to have a longer-term impact once the markets start to see some of the kinds of firm action that Chinese President Xi Jinping has called for in the areas that have been identified by the summit. We also need to bear in mind that most of the speeches and announcements on Monday happened after the markets closed, so we're probably yet to see the reactions even begin. We are likely to see some movement in uh, steel makers here on the stock markets after renewed pledges from the G20 leaders to collectively cut excess capacity. Uh, we are also seeing, uh, already seeing uh, movements in oil producers here in Shanghai. They were gaining after Saudi Arabia and Russia agreed to work together on crude oil production, uh, but we'll have to see what kinds of moves they get because there was no uh, freeze in production agreed to. Back to you, Rochelle. All right, thank you for keeping an eye on the momentum there, Tim Pope, live from Shanghai.